So it's been uh, two weeks, or day number 14 after the breakup, and uh, I have to say I think uh, things are, are feeling better for me right now. So, and it's really been about opening up to the possibilities, uh, the endless possibilities and opportunities that life has to offer. And working through the process of healing and letting go of that image, that uh, dream uh, and fantasy of what I thought my relationship with my ex was uh, and who I thought that she was. So a big part of my uh, journey of the last two weeks has been uh, honoring that dream and, and uh, realizing it. Uh, what it really was, uh, accepting that and then letting go of it. Uh, the other thing is uh, really about uh, forgiving ourselves, uh, forgiving your partner, your ex, uh, for whatever role they had in the breakup or whatever negative experiences you may have had with them, uh, and uh, forgiving myself uh, for whatever feelings and emotions I have related to it. So forgiveness of myself or, you know, feeling like failure or uh, that I wasn't good enough for this person when in reality, you are as good as you're ever gonna be in this moment. You're, those projections that people put on you that you're not uh, are wrong. And of course, you, you know, you can improve yourself, improve your life, I'm not saying that, I'm just saying that you, in whatever moment you're seeing this, are perfect in that moment, and you're just the way you're meant to be in that moment, and don't let anyone else tell you differently, okay? I hope you guys have a great day. Day number 14, made it past two weeks without any hugely or crazily insane drama, so that's, that's good news. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be shooting uh, these videos every day uh, going forward, but I may make one a week just just updating on where I'm at uh, for, for those who are interested um, and again for those uh, for, for my children possibly to see in the future so they, they can learn something from this because uh, breakups are, are the, one of the hardest things. For me, breakups are even harder to accept than the loss of a loved one through a death which it, maybe it's odd, but that's just part of, part of me, is that it's harder to let somebody go that's still alive than someone who's taken uh, or moved on in a spiritual way. So um, I hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for listening. Bye.